you know, there was a moment before it was, you know, the, the pandemic and so forth. You made a decision to leave San Francisco and actually go to New York, you, the original plan. So how was that and why did you do it and how was that move? Like I did it because, uh, I know, we were selling a lot to banks in the retail space and in the wealth management space. And I had to be in New York. Most of our clients were in the East Coast. Uh, we need to have a stronger team. So for me, it was hard, you know, because like I love San Francisco. At the moment, it was like an amazing city. Uh, my life was there, you know, like moving to New York with 31 years old, with a girlfriend and everything. Like I had to start from scratch, you know. Uh, no one knew me, you know, like I had no friends there. I couldn't play my soccer every single week because like, you know, um, but I had to. No, uh, I had to, and it was again, you know, like we always try to measure uh, our decisions, not, uh, not in what we want, but what the company needs. And I think that it's, it's, a, it's a very healthy way of, of, of having like a, a balance between co-founders, you know. Uh, what does the company need? That's now? great. You know? uh, it's, what does the company need versus what we want as a framework for decision making across co-founders that's a, it's a good uh, do you have a specific uh, framework that you guys use whenever you're making big strategic decisions amongst the three of you guys uh, like yeah like it's like we say that Fligo is Fligo's destiny is to be the global leader in, a, in the bit in the enterprise AI space right that's what that's Fligo's destiny that's all. Now, that's where Fleo has to be. Whatever we do in the middle, doesn't matter. You know, that's the company's vision, and we have to do everything. Uh, like we've changed. Like for example, my co-founders have changed positions many times according to the company needs. Juan began be, began being the CFO, then went to be the COO, and now this is like C like COO, but he's the head of sales, you know, and Marcos went from being the CTO to the COO. So these guys are so humble, so humble. My co-founders are, they're willing to do whatever, even if they have to learn everything from scratch, because if you're like the COO and you have to go sell, it's a different, it's a different game. If you're the CTO and you have to be the COO, it's a different game. But these guys, my co-founders are I'm so grateful. I, 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 I'm, I partner with them, you know, like, and, and we try to make decisions based on that, you know, on Fligo's destiny. Uh, and, and that's how we make the hardest decisions. That's beautiful. 